Don't get careless. You want revenge? Bring it! Just keep getting stronger! It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. Just getting warmed up. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not Yuri Lowell! I know you're here in these woods! Turn yourself in like a good boy! You've gotta be kidding me. Lou Blanc followed me all the way outside the barrier? Uh, what? Who followed you? Uh, just some guys from the Imperial Knights. <laughs> yeah, right. The Knights are chasing their own former member. Wait, seriously? I say, come out now, will you? Show yourself now and we'll spare you a pummeling. Shaking in your boots and mere rumors. And you call yourselves Knights of the Schwan Brigade! So... what are they after you for? Vandalism? Fraud? Smuggling? Robbery? Murder? Arson? Uh, it's really just for jailbreak. Anyway, let's bolt. There we go. We can't do that. It'll get in the way of other people passing through. 
Who's going to be passing through? These woods are cursed, remember? General store. back. Have you gotten all the ingredients together? We've got everything. Egg bear claw, nea fruit, and Leluria petals. That's everything. <laughs> all right. Let's get this stuff made. Yes, please. See a bottle. Now we'll be able to cleanse the poison. Let's go quickly. Whoa, whoa, settle down. You'll drop the bottle if you're not careful. Oh, I see. Well, then, let's go.
Oh, have you made the antidote to cleanse the tree of poison? Carol, it's up to you. I'm no good at this sort of thing. Who, me? Okay, then. Here goes. Didn't Carol say there was someone he wanted to show the Blossoms of Halor to? I think so. He was hoping we aren't too late. The tree is... Please, great tree of Halur, restore the fallen barrier. Please. No way! Was the dosage too small? Or maybe this isn't the right way. We'll have to get another panacea bottle. Oh, I'm afraid that's impossible. That was the last of the Luluria petals. But... but we tried so hard. Please, Great Tree. Estelle. City can live once more. What did I just? That was incredible, Estelle. Can you get up? Yuri! Flynn's gonna be so surprised to see the flowers blooming. <laughs> That'll show him. You and Flynn seem to have such a strange relationship. You are friends, aren't you? He's just someone I grew up with, that's all. Ugh. Aren't those the people from the castle? We can't let these people get caught up in this. Let's lay low for a while. Huh? What did I miss? Where are you guys going? Halor's flowers sure are beautiful. I feel like I'm dreaming. Yeah, they're even nicer than I thought they'd be. Yeah, this really makes it feel like our hard work was worth it. Halor shouldn't worry about monsters attacking, as long as the barrier stays like this. Halor's tree will keep everyone safe.
man, those guys are a pain in the neck. Wish we could wait here for Flynn to come back. Who's this Flynn person? He's an Imperial Knight that Estelle's got a crush on. What? I don't have a crush on him. You don't? Oh, I get it. You two are already a thing, then. No, it's not like that at all. Well, anyway, we'd best be getting away from the town. Yes, you're right. You wouldn't want to cause trouble for the villagers. Do you know where this Flynn guy went off to? You could follow after him. Didn't they say he'd gone off to the east? Yes, they did. I'd like to get to Ospio somehow. Anyway, let's get out of here before the goon squad shows up. Please wait. You deserve a reward for restoring our tree. Please stop by at my house. Oh, please don't mind. I will be waiting at my house. Please come. Uh, wait! A reward? What do you say? Well, I guess we can't ignore his offer and leave. I wasn't really sure what I did back there. I don't think I deserve anything. Let's just stop at the mayor's house. We can still decline his offer there. Were those the Red Eyes? So you got both the Imperial Knights and those guys after you? Yeah, I seem to be a big hit with all the weirdos. And what did you do to get so popular? Yeah, there's 21 years worth of stuff. Listing everything might take a while. On second thought, never mind. I don't want to hear it. at home. Thank you, but unfortunately we need to be leaving very soon. Are you leaving before that young knight is back? The situation's changed a bit. Did something come up? You could say that. If there's anything I can do to help, don't hesitate to ask. We appreciate the sentiment, but we can't ask you for your help. I see. Then it's not much, but I'd at least like you to take this. do anything at all but since your friend helped us out so much well then I'd be happy to no we can't take that oh um yeah I, I guess I can't take that but then how will I ever repay you well how about this the next time we come into town set us up with VIP blossom viewing picnic seats that's a great idea I can't wait. All right, then. The next time you're here, I'll put my heart and soul into paying back what you've done for us. Oh, can I ask you one thing? Have you ever heard of a town called Ospio? Ospio? Ah, uh, yes. I believe that was the name of the City of Shade. The City of Shade? From what I've heard, the town lies between tall mountains, and sunlight rarely reaches its gates. Every now and then, a few quiet folks in cloaks and hoods come to our town to get supplies. But they're quite creepy, to be honest. Our town doesn't deal with them much. 
Where is the town located? Towards the east, I think. I wish I could tell you the exact location. Flynn was headed east as well, wasn't he? Yeah, I suppose a city of scholars might have some link to Blastia after all. Thanks. That's all I needed. I'm coming for you, Mortio. This may be a selfish thing to say, but I'm happy this means we're continuing our journey. I haven't known this sort of freedom until now. <laughs> so, Carol, what are your plans? I want to go to the port city and cross over to Tolbekia from there. So I guess it's goodbye then. Huh? Thanks, Carol. It's been fun. Please take care of yourself. On second thought, Maybe I'll stick with you guys a little while longer. Why? You guys would be lost and lonely without me around. Well, you have come in surprisingly handy, Captain. Well then, let's all go together. So, east was it? Yeah, Flynn went east. Okay. I'd like to get to Ospio somehow. Anyway, let's get out of here before the goon squad shows up. So just who is this Flynn guy anyway? Were you and him seeing each other, Estelle? What do you mean, seeing each other? Flynn is Yuri's friend. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Two friends going after the same girl? You got a little wild side, don't you, Estelle? What do you mean, wild side? No, it's all right. You can keep your secrets. He so got the wrong idea. You want revenge? Bring it! Come on! Get out of here! Hold on! Come to me! 
We're done. Guess we can do this. How's this? Drag it over! As you're all right, who's next? It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly.
Let's work together. This? No, this isn't scary. It looks like this is Ospio. It's so gloomy and damp here. It's giving me the chills, too. It's because the city is in a cavern. I wonder if the lack of sun drives the people here to do shady things, like stealing Blastia cores. I see your passport, please. Our passport? This is an Imperial facility. We can't just let anyone inside, can we? Passport? You don't have one of those, do you? An associate of ours is inside. Could you please let us through? If you filled out the official visitation paperwork, then you ought to have gotten your passport from this associate of yours. This is the first we've heard, though. If you won't let us in, perhaps you could call him to the gate for us? What's your associate's name? Mordio. M mordio We can't help you. You'll need to mail in a request and have a passport officially issued to you. Damn. Don't budge an inch, do you? Excuse me. Did a knight by the name of Flynn happen to stop by here? All information about the establishment is classified. We cannot share even small details with outsiders. So you can't even tell me why Flynn was here? No, of course not. So what you're saying is that Flynn really did come here? Uh, I don't know who you're talking about. A knight named Flynn? Never heard of him. Could we at least leave him a message? Give it up, Esteliz. We'd have more luck asking a brick wall for help. Let's just go. But Flynn's inside. What? We're just gonna give up? I'm not going to give up. I'm going to see Flynn. And I'm gonna take back that Blastia from that thief Mordio and give him a beating he won't forget. So can't we look for another way in? Of course we can. Let's take a stroll around, why don't we? As a last resort, maybe we could go over the walls.
doors like this never open when you want them to. I guess we'll have to climb over the wall and open it from the inside. A little quick to jump to our last resort, aren't you? Let's wait for Flynn to come out then. Even if Flynn comes out, it's not like he's gonna bring Mordio out with him. Well, if Flynn comes outside, we can just ask him to let us in, can't we? He'd never go for a plan like this. It's far too much of a goody-goody. Carol, what are you doing? There! It's open! Huh? You can't do that! Your guild specializes in hunting monsters, right? Or are you guys into thieves' guild type stuff too? <laughs> um, yeah, well, I'm pretty much the only one who can do anything like this. Well, good job. Shall we? No, that's bad. We should just wait here for Flynn. I don't have the patience to wait for Flynn to just happen to walk out of this town by chance. It was unquestioning obedience to laws and authority in times like this that made me quit the Imperial Knights in the first place. But... but... Well then, Estelle, keep a look out here for us, won't you? Wait, but... but... um... I'm going with you. Man, there are a lot of Mordio lookalikes here, aren't there? Excuse me. Do you have a minute? Well, what do you want? Would you happen to know if a knight named Flynn Shifo has come through here? Flynn? Oh, that guy. He was saying something about going to catch someone who'd been vandalizing ruins. Where is he now? I couldn't say. My research keeps me too busy to pay attention to things like that. I... I see. I'm sorry to interrupt you. I'll be taking my leave then. Hey, wait up. Tell me one more thing. Is there a famed mage named Mordio around here? Yeah, there are people who want to see that weirdo. So I was right. You know Mordio? No, uh, I don't know anything at all. I don't associate with people like that. Hey, I'm not done yet. What? What is it? Tell me where the mage is. Mordio lives alone in a shack back that way. Go and see for yourself if you want. Thanks. Are you sure about this? Hmm? Everyone seems to get all out of sorts just from hearing that guy's name. It's weird. Yeah. Doesn't it bother you? Well, he's a blast, you thief. It's no wonder people don't like him. You know, Yuri, your attitude... Your behavior, they don't seem very... knightly. Where'd that come from? I mean, we're entering the city through a back entrance, like thieves. This coming from the guy who picked the lock. I'm just tagging along to find Flynn, and now you've turned me into a thief! We haven't stolen anything! Sheesh!
This city sure has a lot of books. I'm not really too crazy about reading. I have a hard time sleeping in this place. Yeah, you seem like you're too jittery to sit still and look at something for too long. You're one to talk. Hey, what happened to Estelle? She's been over there reading books ever since we got here. Hmm. Estelle, time to get going. Hmm. Once she starts reading, you can't pull her away. Huh? Did you say something? This seems to be literature from an ancient civilization. She's not even listening. Keep out. Seriously. Mordio. I guess this is the place. I think people usually try knocking first. Looks like no one's home. What should we do? No point in hesitating when you're heading into a den of thieves. No, I don't want us to commit any more crimes. I guess that means it's my turn then. What? Your turn? We shouldn't do that either. Nothing to it. Wait for me! Please, wait. Why does he always do that? This is crazy. Who could live in a place like this? You can pretty much live anywhere you can eat and sleep if you set your mind to it. Yuri. Don't you have something to say first? Uh, hello? We're coming in. And the door? Carol here, open your door. Sorry about that. Honestly, Yuri. Excuse us. Is anyone home? It's a good thing no one's here. That means we get to look for evidence. tricks like that. Why'd you bother skipping town back in Zafius? Huh? Skipping town? Why would I need to skip town? For stealing the core of Ablastia from the lower quarter in the capital. What else? What? You're calling me a thief. Have you ever heard of common sense? Sure. So you break into a home, call the owner a thief, and wave a sword in their face. What the hell kind of sense is that? Hey, dog! You stay back, you... you dog! And you, kid! 
Give them back. What do you mean? The Blastia, the Blastia, give them back to me. What's with you? My name is Esteliz. We're terribly sorry for barging in on you like this. Yuri, Carol, you too. Sorry. So, what do you want? Well, you see, Yuri has followed a Blastia thief here all the way from the Imperial capital. And? And that Blastia thief wore a cape, was short, and their name was Mordio. So? Hmm. Well, Mordio is certainly my name. Rita Mordio, to be exact. And the height matches up, too! What do you have to say for yourself? I told you, I have no idea what you're... Oh, I hadn't thought of that. Follow me. What? Maybe you didn't hear me. We're not finished here. Just follow me, would you? There's talk that some thieves have turned up in the Shikos ruins. Thieves? Are you sure about that? It came from an Imperial Knight who asked me for help. It should be trustworthy. Do you think that knight might have been Flynn? It's gotta be. Looks like she shot him down, though. Hey, remember what that guy outside said about someone vandalizing the ruins? Which means the thief who stole the Blastia Corps could be there. Hmm, maybe. Finished chatting? Let's go. All right, but don't even think of making a break for it. You don't have to come. If you want, I'll just call the guards. Why don't we give it a try? It sounds like Flynn might even be there. It's up to you. Go to jail, make a run for it, or follow me. Pick one. Okay, okay. We'll go with you. The Shikos ruins are even further to the east, once you leave the city. Rita's a little scary, huh? Really? She's about what I'd expect. Seems like she's in a crappy mood, too. That's because you broke into her house, Yuri. I don't exactly feel like being on my best behavior when I'm dealing with a core thief. What will you do if you're wrong about her? If I'm wrong, I'll apologize. You'd better remember that when the time comes. Oh, were you listening? I just happened to overhear. So you think I'm scary, do you? Watch it, Carol. She's definitely the kind to hold a grudge. Hey! D don't scare me like that! Your name is Estelise, right? Yes, but that's kind of long to say easily. Please call me Estelle. You look like some fancy noble, Estelise. Why are you with that jerk? Oh, I think that Yuri is a good person. And really, I don't mind if you call me Estelle. All right, Estelise. She's tough.
Repeat's getting really good at handling items, don't you think? Yeah, but I don't want to eat any gels that have been in a dog's mouth. He said, come on, don't be like that. If things go bad, take it. That's one big mouth he's... Wait a minute, did he really say that? All I heard him do was bark. Stick around long enough and you'll figure him out. Right, Repeat? You look a little jealous, Rita. <laughs> no way! It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. These are the Shikos ruins. It looks like there aren't any Imperial Knights around. These footprints are still fresh. There's a lot of them, too. Which means it's either the knights, the thieves, or both. Some of these footprints must be Flynn's. Could be. Hey, over here, hurry up! I see. So first you get us alone in the dark, then you zap us, huh? Hmm, zap. I like the way that sounds. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Why are you smiling like that? Let's try to get along now, okay? Looks like no one's here. No Imperial Knights, Thieves, or anyone else. Maybe they're further in? How far in are we talking here? It doesn't look like anyone's been here, does it? The information about the Underground couldn't have gotten out, could it? The Underground? Recently, an entrance to an Underground area was uncovered here. A handful of mages are supposed to be the only people who know about it. But it's okay for us to know this? I don't have much choice if I'm to clear my name, do I? Clear your name, huh? The ground is scratched here. It's not like I would have minded letting the thieves have the ruins above ground after we finished the excavation. But it's a good thing we came here when we did. Well then, we'd better hurry up and follow them. All we have to do is move this? Come on, you have to put your shoulder into it. Um, right. Huh? Come on, just a little more. Carol, 
Are you okay? Sure, yeah, that was a cinch. <sighs> okay, here we go. This is my first time going inside ruins. Be careful over there, it's slippery. What are you looking at? I was just surprised. You're actually a nice person. Oh, I knew it would be a pain to bring you along. I should have just come by myself. Do you always come to research these ruins alone? Yeah. Aren't you afraid you'll get hurt by monsters or traps? There are always risks if you're trying to actually do something. If someone gets hurt, it's an acceptable loss. Even if you're the one who gets hurt? Yeah. Don't you ever worry or hesitate? Worrying about getting what you want without anyone getting hurt? You've had a pretty easy life. An easy life? And Blastia will never betray me, so they're easy to deal with. Rita's amazing. She just comes right out and says what she has to say. She knows exactly what's important to her. I wish I knew what was important to me. Just travel around for a while. You'll figure it out. These ruins feel very different once you're inside them. Yeah, it's weird. And there's all this stuff I've never seen before. What, is this your first time too, Carol? Well, yeah. My specialty's monster hunting. Hey, what do you think this is? You really shouldn't be fooling around over there. This place is loaded with traps. Did anyone else just hear a click? Carol, watch out! Ah! Sorry, I thought you were about to get killed. I overdid it. I think I would have been better off getting caught in the trap. Looks like this little one is no good. Wow, 
So this is what Blastia look like before they're excavated. I wonder why ancient people buried Blastia in ruins like this in the first place. I wish I could tell you. That's something else being researched. With all these Blastia here, I don't suppose there are any Aqua Blastia lying around too. None of them have cores in them. Really? Then they don't work, do they? Blastia aren't excavated with the cores and the bodies together. Cores produce magic through formulas. Bodies control that magic. The two combined are referred to as Blastia. Each Blastia possesses different attributes and is marked by a crest that indicates those attributes. With current technology, Blastia bodies can be manufactured, but the production of Blastia cores is impossible. So basically, cores are very valuable since they have to be excavated. It's only natural that thieves would want to steal them. That's not quite true. It seems Estelisa's information is a little outdated. What's outdated about it? There's some degradation of quality, but there's been some success in the synthesis of simple Blastia cores. Really? That's why I wouldn't do anything stupid, like go stealing people's cores. If I had time to waste doing things like that, I'd rather be spending it researching better ways to completely restore incomplete or degraded cores. That's what being a mage is all about. The Noble Creed? But that doesn't clear your name. Yes, talk is cheap, I suppose. Perhaps there is still some Blastia left that can be used. One's still got a core in it. Here, try shooting this at the core. This ring set with something that looks just like a Blastia core. Glyph crystallization of a formula allows this Blastia to emit air as needed. That's not quite the best way to put it. It's actually used to charge other Blastia with air. But wait, how did you know that? In the castle, I read that the ring acts as a kind of key in ancient ruins. Castle? So all I do is point? Just aim the sorcerer's ring at the core of that Blastia. Face your target and shoot. There's a limit to its range, though. Go on, try it. That's all it takes. That's a Strim Crest. It's a mark that indicates movement. Huh. Interesting. for taking care of unwanted guests. Okay then, keep your eyes open and let's keep moving. Are you sure? What if I'm just luring you deeper into the ruins so I can zap you? I'm starting to think I'd rather try my luck with the golem. Here, you take it. Isn't this thing important or something? We'll need to use it a few more times. Okay, I guess I'd better hold it since I'm leading the way. I wonder if people a long time ago used little rings like this to move things around. Yes, items like this have been discovered in other ruins as well. It sure is useful for something so small. Yeah, unlike some people I could name. Huh? It's impressive that you've been entrusted with a sorcerer's ring, Rita. I've heard they're only given to a very small number of people. <laughs> Guess someone trusts you. You're the only one who doesn't. There's no way you could win. Hey, 
didn't you say something about the castle not too long ago? Oh? Yes, well, you see... Yeah, I was in the castle a while back. I used to be a knight. You? A knight? Please, how gullible do you think I am? Believe it or not, it's true. Will wonders never cease? Is it really so hard for everyone to believe that? Come on, let's go. Hey, they changed the subject on me. We're done. It looks like they've messed up our order. Let's take them down. <laughs> Think you can beat us with an ambush? <laughs> Monsters don't think. That was scary. I didn't expect to be ambushed from behind like that. Well, I guess we just can't ever let our guard down where there are monsters about. If they attack from the rear, any of us could get pulled into battle. Right. Let's be careful and hope that doesn't happen again. Hmm. This only happens with a preemptive attack. Preemptive attacks, huh? What? You guys! It's back! Hit it with what I gave you just now! Huh? You mean with this? Do it now! Just go away! We'll strike! Odin of this modest land! Star Strike! Stop! Oh, Blue Green burn! We finished them off! I finished them off. Huh? I feel power running off the- I just keep getting stronger! I get it now, so that's how it works. I didn't know it could be used like that, too. Right, let's get a move on. Rita, you seem very used to fighting for someone who's been doing research in Ospio for so long. I'm just used to using magic, and I've been working to cultivate a calm mind. A calm mind, huh? Is there something wrong with that? Ooh, ouch! Sorry, I thought you were a monster. Ugh, I'll startle you someday. You just wait. Let's get this over with. You want revenge? Bring it! Hey, I learned something. These are the threads that weave our future. I feel this power!
work. You want revenge? Bring it! Oh, I feel so powerful! I won't lose!
<laughs> I got a little worked up. collapsed, we'd be buried alive. What are you saying stuff like that for, Estelle? What if that really happened? Come on, don't be such a wimp. These ruins are made of stronger stuff than that. Ah! Estelle! Now the ceiling's gonna collapse because you were talking about it! Huh? No, oh, sorry, I just stubbed my toe on a rock. You did that on purpose, didn't you? Yuri, you're mean. Come on! Let's hurry and finish up what we're doing so we can get out of these ruins. Quick! Ha! 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 Ha!
Let's get this over with. You want revenge? Blastia too? But what I want is the Aqua Blastia, not this this puppet. What are you doing? Don't just go poking at him like that. If I can just analyze him, I'll finally be able to complete my anima formula. No, his Blastia core is missing. Rita, looks like one of your friends is here. Are you M me I'm just a blast here researcher from Ospio that sounded convincing and just who are all of you this place is off limits you know I think you just gave yourself away I don't know who you are but you're definitely not from Ospio if you don't recognize me guess she's got no problems with modesty Yeah, this job is just full of problems. 
If it's not the knights, it's a bunch of kids. Ah, it's moving! Rita! Let me see. Wait a minute. What? How did you... I was just trying to heal your wounds. Hey, you guys! Stop playing around and help us! Ugh. All right, all right! I'm going after that idiot. You all take care of this. What do you mean you'll leave it to us? How are you gonna get through? Oh, that idiot! I guess we've got no choice but to play with this wind-up toy for now. Let's get this over with and go after that jerk. I can't believe... Leave this thing's... Move it! Be careful. He doesn't know how to go easy on people. Can we really defeat something this big? Please, calm down. I don't think this thing's gonna listen. Lastia have hearts, too! The sword works better on crazy things like this. Uh, fine. We gotta teach him a lesson. Let them use Blastia for evil. Let's go chase him down. Oh man, no break? I feel power running all through my body. Hmm. Okay, sure. Oh, I feel so powerful. All that's left is to cut off its power supply. I'm sorry. Rita, hurry! All right, all right! Come on, let's go! But Flynn... There can't be many knights here if our shady friend in the cloak is just wandering around. So you think Flynn is... I don't think he's here anymore. Come on! If I just had a little more time, I could have figured out the Anima formula. Is that why we were fighting that thing? Of course. You suck! You were already here looking for the thief. I just had you guys help out a little. Let's go, let's go! Please, stop it, 
You stole cores from the Imperial Capital, too, didn't you? The Capital? No way, not me! Then maybe it was one of your friends. Y yeah, it's that Crete Dedeki! Where'd he run off to? He's probably picking up his money from the client right now! Client, huh? And who exactly might that be? All I know is he's somewhere in Torum Harbor. I, I don't know any more than that! He was a huge bruiser of a guy with a scar on his right cheek and one eye missing. So is this the guy collecting all the cores? And where did you steal that sorcerer's ring? Who, who says I stole it? The client gave it to me, said it would be useful for this job. Liar. That's not something the boss of some pickpockets could get his hands on. Uh, honest, you gotta believe me. This thing sounds pretty big. You think somebody important is behind it all? I think you're on the right track, Captain Carroll. This doesn't sound like some ordinary band of thieves. Man, first the knight, then the monsters, now this? Knight? Then Flynn was here after all. Yeah, that's him. That damn knight! Shut up! Great, Rita. You knocked him out. Now what? I'll have the city guards come pick him up later. All right, then. Let's get back to Ospio.
animations all over the place. This is awesome. Yeah, I beat you in the next. So Flynn wasn't in there either. So, who is this knight exactly? He's Yuri's friend. Hmm, your friend? That must be a pain. Huh? Never mind. So what brings him to this town? He was looking for a mage to repair Halur's barrier blastia. Oh, that rookie. He came to see me too. Flynn did? Was he alright? Yeah, I guess. You guess? Well, since he's a knight, I'm sure he got some mage or another to help. Maybe he's already back in Halur. Oh, no. Well, do you trust me yet? I don't think Reed is the sort of person to steal. Vouch for her character all you like, but that doesn't prove her innocence. But... Don't bother trying to make him believe me. But I really didn't do it, you know. <laughs> well, I guess research seems to fit you better than robbery. Yuri isn't very good at expressing his feelings. What a weirdo. I'm gonna go let the city guards know about what happened. Go and wait for me in my lab. I don't think those stubborn guards will let us pass through the entrance. True. Then take this with you. Show this to the guard and they should let you through. Thanks. Got it? Don't leave town without my permission, or you'll be sorry. It's a good thing the core thief you're chasing turned out not to be Rita, right, Yuri? Huh? <laughs> How do you figure that? I couldn't care less who the core thief was. I would have loved it if it were Rita. <laughs> I'd be done by now. I wouldn't let her hear you say that. Well, at least we got a lead for catching the real criminal. I can't complain about that. <laughs>